Okay, so we are testing out the self-driving of the Hyundai Elantra in traffic. So you can see we are inside Chicago right now, and I will tell you the traffic is ridiculous. My feet are off the brakes and the wheel right now, but you can see it's accelerating by itself because it has stop-go cruise control. It's gonna slow down for this car in front of us. My feet are not on the brakes or gas. Uh, and yeah, I'm, you know, I'm paying attention. I can quickly hit it if I need to, but you can see, you know, it's self-driving itself. It's, it's gonna accelerate right now because the car is moving. It is a little sluggish to speed up, but you know, overall, pretty nice. And you can see the beautiful towers and skyscrapers of Chicago. Uh, unfortunately, there was like an accident or something, and that's why we're stuck in this. But once this car moves, the car is going to accelerate, and then it's going to quickly slow down because the car is stopping. But yeah, again, feet are off the gas and brakes, and we are still accelerating. And we also don't need to have our hands on the wheel because the car is driving itself, but I still will. Um, and yeah, this is just one of the, one of my favorite features with this Elantra. <laughs> I'm so happy I got the stop and go cruise control just because, you know, so much more convenient. Like it's going to stop. We're probably going to go to a dead stop pretty soon. And once you go to a dead stop, you have about three seconds until the car in front of you can go. Otherwise you have to press this button to continue or hit the gas, but you can see it's crawling at six miles an hour. I have my cruise control set to 39 miles an hour, but you know, it's obviously not even going to go that fast, but it's going to accelerate and there's a car going to cut in here. Hopefully it should detect that. And it did. So yeah, it, it braked before that car even got fully in front of me, which is definitely a good feature in case someone cuts you off while you have this on, but it's going to keep slowing down and speeding up. So yeah, my foot is, is saved. I don't need to keep my foot on the gas and the brake. So this is definitely saving my foot from hurting later. Uh, but yeah, this is definitely one of my favorite features for this car. And also, again, the wheel controlling itself, making sure we're staying in the lane and uh, stopping. It got a little close earlier, um, so now it's slowing down. It got pretty close to one of the cars that we went to. Um, that was only one time. But overall, it usually keeps about this much distance between the car in front of us. So, yeah, let me know what you guys think of this down below. Um, I have my follow us distance set to the minimum, and that way it's hard for cars to cut out in front of me. If there's too much of a distance, people might want to jump in. But... Yeah, let's see if we can get up to higher speeds pretty soon. We have 10 minutes of traffic. Holy cow. I hate traffic, bro. <laughs> the beautiful city. At least we have a nice little scenic view. Uh, this would get tiring if we had to do this every day. But yeah, self-driving to its max. It's going to slow down. And it's probably going to stop for us, hopefully. Get down to zero miles an hour, maybe. Okay, and now it's going to stop start going again it's a little slow to start um you can see cars around us are moving up but once it kicks in it starts going uh and it's going to keep being slowing down but uh yeah pretty fancy i love this feature coming to a stop again beautiful See, I've just been sitting here. My hands have been off the wheel and the gas, and now it's going to accelerate because we have an opening, um, and it should slow down just like that. So, yeah, my hands and, and feet have not been touching controls for the past, like, minute or two, so that's definitely a nice move. So, yeah, not too close to the car in front of us, uh, but definitely, definitely nice. Okay, so now we're, we're stopped. It probably won't go again. Okay, so yeah, it just says to switch uh, back on, we have to hit the gas or this button. So let's hit the button and now it'll move us forward. So yeah, that's just the safety mechanism. You can't be stopped for more than like three seconds. So if you're staying in a stop situation for like 10 seconds or 20 seconds, you do have to press that button or hit the gas to get going. But uh, yeah, the great city of Chicago. <laughs> All right, that's the video.